this is your text and it starts off with the swaraha halaha i'm sure you all know the basic letters i don't need to go through that this book has telugu kannadam tamil malayalam uh, uh, you know equivalents so you can go through that also do you want me to go through the vowels or not you just let me know then uh, we can move on i had couple of uh... Just yeah. couple of Aksharas, I, I had questions. Uh, essentially, the pronunciation. Mm. Uh, that uh, after R, is it L or L? L. Uh, L. 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 Okay. And, so, uh, like, like as in click thumb, L. It is a vowel. Okay. So that mm. one, and then uh, uh, it goes to the uh, consonants. Okay. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> I, I like the uh, uh, essentially the uh, a few things. Let me point out. Uh, okay, uh, one of the things uh, I wanted was uh, between. Uh, I might go have the der and der. Okay, this one. Uh, for, yeah, those two. I want to get a good pronunciation. I I often uh, make, mess those things too. Um. So okay. The simple way to understand this is K is non-aspirated. You know, in English, if you look at the English, uh, uh, compare the way it is pronounced, you say K and K. Generally, one H sound is coming from K or G. If you are Tamil and you only used to Tamil letters, then it will be difficult to pronounce this. Uh, but... Uh, in the intermediate alone kadaya the tamil we don't have that in tamil but other languages have it you telugu kannada malayalam all of them have it okay even in tamil if you are used to grantham reading grantha script then you will know these letters uh, cha cha so the way you pronounce if you know how to pronounce ka kha ga gha think of the place of articulation and use the same effort that you used to pronounce ka kh ga and gha if you think of kh kh ga gha you are actually coming from the throat to the front of the mouth that is how the letters are arranged here so kh starts from the kantha right kh kh ga gha and then ng has a nasal sound there right it starts from the kantha the next is talu which a lot of people have some difference of opinions it is cheek and gra chila per some people say it is the palate uh, or the soft palate and all that so wherever you pronounce your cha the same place is where you are going to pronounce the rest of the letters also cha cha ja jha you don't stop the first two you are going to stop and pronounce cha Ch, which is the so softer ones, and then j, j. You are keep think of the same place of articulation. That's all. Wherever you are pronouncing the first letter, the same goes for t. T is more dhanya. It goes to the top roof of the mouth. So t is where you are pronouncing. Then d also comes in the same place. T and d also in the same place. So you will never make a mistake in the pronunciation that way. And now, then you come to the teeth. Dantya, tatha, dadha, na. Then it is pa. You come to the lips part. Pa, pa, ba, ba, ma. So that's how you go from the kantha to the oshta for the pronunciation. That's how the table has been arranged here. Then yara, la, va are all uh, in between letters. அதுக்கப்புறம் ஷ ஷ ச ஹ இருக்கு இல்லையா நோ திஸ் இஸ் ஷ ஃபாலோஸ் த ப்ரனன்சியேஷன் ஆஃப் ச வேர் எவர் யூ ஆர் டூயிங் ச தட் இஸ் வேர் யூ ஆர் கோயிங் டு ப்ரனவுன்ஸ் ஷ திஸ் இஸ் வெரி டிஃப்ரெண்ட் ஃப்ரம் தெலுங்கு ப்ரனன்சியேஷன் வேர் யூ சே ச சிவ இல்ல இங்க வந்து யூ வில் ஹாவ் டு ப்ரனவுன்ஸ் இட் எஸ் ஷ சிவ wherever cha comes that is where you are going to keep place your mouth or your tongue and pronounce sha sha would be like ta tha da dha na sha and then sa is danta ta tha da dha na sa ha is like ka ka kha ga ga ha 
that's the difference here between these four and uh, uh, yeah three more uh, consonants than the nasal ones uh, in the huh. kavarga and the chavarga huh. the same thing so wherever you are pronouncing ka that is where you are going to bring in the nasal ka nga cha nya tamil therinja romba sauriyu ka nga cha nya ta na ta na pa ma ya ra la va correct ah vandru ungalku adhe it's just the same place of articulation so ka nga cha nya ta na ta na pa ma okay yeah uh there are some words here if you want we can go through the meanings uh in these words uh yeah anybody else has any question okay the next is samyukta aksharam we can go through that samyukta aksharas also uh, uh they have uh, words for those also idella ezhudi paakanum you have to write and see all these words and the letters so that it's easier okay quick question ma ah uh. ஒருத்தர்ச்சுவச்சனம் <laughs> so oh. apaha is a very specific word which is only in bahuvachanam and it's a strilinga padam oh okay. yeah okay adu mari or class of things are called some special technical term irka appadi kadaiyadu illa there are certain words which can be nitya bahuvachanam nitya strilingam oh. so uh, like daraha it's a nitya uh, bahuvachanam and nitya pullingam but it means it indicates wife okay so on madri uh, uh there are words like that so there is no specific class of words as you read as you practice you will come across such words and you will learn about those words so this is for the more advanced people anala uh, don't worry about it yeah ina next uh therila artho ina kula tilaka ina na suryan oh ina ha suryan okay mm. oh okay yeah oh under i mean <laughs> it's a win uh, kanchi mahal periwa has said that inaha is one of the reasons why the people who are sun worshippers in this part of south america they use the word incans so, ah inka ama inka ama uh, ina adha for the sanya ha it's uh, inakulapta right for some uh, for those who know sangeetam inakula uh, inakula is a very common word in sangeetam hmm uh, kirtanalla la varu அனசுலோனி மர்மம் இந்த இருக்கும் இனக்கு தனி ஆமா ஆ நெக்ஸ்ட் ஈஷஹ ஈஸ்வரஹ ஈஷஹ சோ பரமேஸ்வரஹ இட் கேன் பீ சிவா இட் கேன் மீன் ஈஷஹ கேன் ஆல்சோ இன்டிகேட் விஷ்ணு बिकॉज ஒன் ஹூ இஸ் a கண்ட்ரோலர் இஸ் ஈஷ ம் தென் உரஹ உரஹ செஸ் மார்ப எனக்கு தெரியல uh oh that is double reverb yeah right. this should be there should be a double one i can't do it in adobe <laughs> okay i don't know how to do it in this so r karaha usually r is a double c madri varum mm. to write it yeah then l karaha l karaha r karaha these are all just it is just saying that r iti varnaha it is mm. a letter called r l iti varnaha ittiyada okay ah ah eshah means this in masculine even abrin solrom liya in it's only masculine yeah ah mm. uh, uh, aikyam uh, mm. one uh, be, uh, oneness becoming one hmm becoming na varnongra avasiyam illa aikyam is just oneness 
Oh, oneness. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, tadanantaram Ojaha. Ojaha. Uh, it's a spiritual splendor, no Sholama. Now, Ojas is one day, Balam. So, at the one day, Ojas is actually... Uh, also body part, right? It's a uh, Datu. Sapta Datu is one day. Ah, Sapta Datu is uh, one day. But Ojaha is more like an Antara Balam. Prakasham. Ah. Mano Balam. Ojas. Hmm. Okay. Uh, then Aurvaha. Uh-huh. Aurvaha Uroho Bhavaha Aurvaha. So one who is a descendant. Abdinuna Ilana Thai Lair in the Vanda Abdinatri. Oh yeah. uh, Aurva is a Rishi. So Aurva Nala uh, Aurva. Uh, is a rishi who created that uh, agni which is there inside the ocean which is supposed to keep the ocean in check and oh. that agni came from a rishi rishi's thai uru so aurvaha aurvaha so, is actually aurvaha, an agni aurvaha na agni ah ama agni oh ah uh, so ipo dhan kandupidichen idu so this should usually be like this rendu see inge varanum uh, and the Rikara English. <laughs> Yeah. And Amsaha. Uh, Amsaha na told uh, shoulders. Shoulder. Amsaha is uh, shoulder. Got it. Uh, aha, so here it is Saha. Yeshaha is this person, masculine. Saha is that person, uh, someone who is far off. Ekavachana. Hmm. Ekavachana. Okay. Uh, now, these are all, again, the set of let, uh, words here. Someone wants to try? I can try. Okay. Oh, you, you, I can just pronounce. I, I don't know the meaning. Or uh, What did okay. you want? You can try. <laughs> In, see, these words are all very similar to what we already know. So, Arnala, uh, I will say the meaning. That's fine. Okay. Karaha. Hmm. Related to something to hand. Related in hand. Kalaha. Okay. Uh, Kalaha ah, is a bad person. Gajaha, elephant. Mm-hmm. Dhanaha, uh, wealth. Uh, gha, no, dhanaha, dhanam is wealth. Ghanaha, this is gha. Oh, is so the difference between, uh, difference between gha and dha, Patelna, ha, if you look at it. So this you don't have the line here. Here yeah, you have the line on top. So it's ga, right? Yes, Ganaha. it is ga. Ganaha okay. megha cloud. And it also means ghana can mean thick. As an adjective, it can be used to refer anything that is thick. Chayaha. Chayaha is a heap. Anybody else can chime in with the meaning. You can keep yourself open and uh, yeah, if you know. Huh. Is uh, it comes in uh, Agni Chayanam. Uh, collection. Collection. Mm. It, I think it, it can also mean choice depending on context. The choice. Chayanam mm. perhaps. I have sure. heard that usage only in modern Sanskrit. That Chayanam is choice. Uh, you're not okay. Mm. I have mm. not come across the, in mm. uh, it. Mm. Huh. Next does one. Rishi Chayavanaha, does it he? It comes Chiyavanaha. From... That Chiyavanaha? is Chia. No. Chia. Ich Ya. Oh, Chiyavana. Okay. Chiyavana. Chadaha. Next. Hmm. Chadaha. What is Chadaha? Chadaha, no? Our skin. Yeah. Hmm. Jadaha. Chada can mean a covering. Achadaha. Achadanam. Chadaha is a covering, or it can mean sometimes a sheath uh, for a um, knife. That is also chadaha. Huh. Jadaha is mm. trunk. Huh? Jadam, ch- trunk? 
Tranka. One doesn't move. The body. That's what. I, lifeless. Trunk. Oh, body. Life. So jada is lifeless. No. Yeah. Something jada mar kar de. Yeah. It's yeah, not yeah. the trunk of the body, but it's more like jada is lifeless, lifeless. which doesn't have chit in it. That is jada. Uh, Jasha. Ah, uh, ja. So ja here is different from this ja. Yeah, yeah. Jasha. 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 Fish. Fish. Yes. It's actually jasha is more like in the Tamil na timingilambo, periya something like a shark or it's a bigger fish. Meena ha is a small fish, whereas jasha ha is a bigger one. That's why you say Meena Akshi. You don't say jasha Akshi for her. Kataha. Mazel. Kataha is a pie mm, mat. Carpet. Oh, Madam. Uh, Last. Yeah. ஜெயம் <laughs> 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 இருக்கலாம் வெச்சு போமே that is a class of question you can note down in a book hari is our vyutpatti vaad vaadin <laughs> nice that's a good point i think it's ma matha hmm. hmm. matha ha mat madam சொல்றோம் இல்லையா மட் மட் லைக் ஆஸ் இன் ஷிங்கேரி மட் காஞ்சி மட் அண்ட் ஆல் தட் மட் ஹா டமரு இஸ் தி தஷிவாஸ் ஆர் டமரு எஸ் தி வெபன் உடுக்கை உடுக்கை டகஹ டகஹ இஸ் ஆல்சோ தி சேம் ல டக்கா மாதிரி தானே டக் ஒன் ஹஸ் ஒன் யூ கேன் ஹிட் ஆன் போத் சைட்ஸ் அண்ட் ஒன் யூ கேன் ஹிட் ஓனி ஆன் ஒன் சைட் Uh, in uduk the wire is in the middle and you do this it hits on either side that is dabara in dhakka it is a semi circular thing and you hit it inde madri ganjira mari amaru ha ganjira ganjira is yeah, yeah, i don't know i don't similar. know similar one side yeah one side yeah okay kanaha hmm. kanaha is ur kanam a thudi a bit a moment or a moment it can a be a bit it can be both fraction of time or a particle it can indicate both okay hmm. tanu body ah illa tanu body na tanuhu irukum tanu oh. is a little no. something that is slim is tanu little bit if there is a visarga here then it can mean body ha next one மாதவி விஷ்ணு Oh, Madhava. Okay. Ah, Lakshmi's husband is Vishnu. Uma Dhavaha, Uma Yaha Dhavaha Patihi is Shiva. So, Uma Dhavaha and Ma Dhavaha. Okay, Ma Dhavaha, I yeah, know. Yeah, Ma Dhavaha. That you said was Dhavati, I think. Dhavati. Yeah, Dhavati. Uh, no, that is different. Idu and the Harihara Vedas to Tila Dikshita Rupar, right? Ah, Ma Dhavam, Uma Dhavam. It starts off with that, right? And then, Harihara Vedas to Tila. okay for the for the telugu speakers the, you know daddu janam right yeah yeah so that's from daddi ah apdi vera solluvala da i should daddu learn janam. telugu so <laughs> you uh, it is uh, you know that is a standard uh, phrase in all uh, perumal koyil right ama daddu nam theriyum daddu danam avlo dooram ad they don't uh, expand it so much and say adena daddi bhojanam irundathu ninnu theory daddojanam appara poichu daddojanam aichu that's the ah okay can you clarify what have he is from tirupati 
பட் இன் தமிழ் இட்ஸ் வெரி கிளியர்லி தத்தியன்னம் ஆர் தி பிளஸ் அன்னம் தத்தியன்னம் அது தத்தியன்னம் அப்படின்னு மறுவிடுத்து மீனிங் <laughs> thinking how you knew it bakasuran kada therinjadana then you will know it's a crane right uh, bataha i don't know this warrior Wa- bataha Wa- is a, a member of the army bataha warrior telugu lo batulu raja batulu third guard uh, but mm. cross guard <laughs> uh, manaha is it mind mind yes yamaha uh, yama it... god yama or oh, yeah. yama niyama asana pratyahara yeah, that's where i was so, going yama niyama pa bye rata ha chariot next lava ha lava lava lesham cholrom lya you have you come across that lava is the pusha that Sorry, someone was asking what is the meaning of yama yama ah, yama is god of death yama the other one is yama niyama asana pratyahara those are ashtanga yoga in yoga you have eight parts the first part is yama control of sense organs mm-hmm. which is called that yama but is, is yama or yama is that yama yama it, that is also yama that is also yama in sanskrit okay it's like a, it's like a motorbike yama <laughs> <laughs> I you know the there is a one uh, teacher of mine who Actually, would give a vyutpatti for yamaha he said yama mapi hanti iti yamaha the one that can even kill yama <laughs> oh, i was thinking uh, you need discipline to control the bike therefore it is yamaha ha oh that's nice <laughs> next one lavaha lavaha is a little bit uh, someone so, asked whether it was salt that is lavana right yes but, that is lavanam huh. but uh, the the two parts of the dharba mm. one was lava and the other was kusha right isn't that this so it was the mm. top part was lava and the other or the bottom part was lava wasn't that the origin kusha kusha is a dharba grass no but uh, when they brought that to sita mata they had to kind of break it into two because they were twins so one okay. part became lava and the other part became kusha this right one. lava kusha i thought that was okay. the okay i didn't know about that i only thought that it was just a name that were given to his, their uh, children uh, i not sure if lava itself is a uh, grass uh, no it is a part of the darba grass the uh, part one part became lava and the other part became no, lava is usually lavanam is cutting so kusha lava kusha is grass and lava is cutting so i'm i don't Here, think lavana for which indicates cutting what nakaram is it oh that is yeah. na, anything with to do with your na, ah, lavana dane varu amma vera varadu rasha vanda da na varu tower ga na va ta dantyam dental okay danta so uh, next lavanam the ganga jala lava iti asmakam stotra priyanam krite ganga jala lava kanika pita ganga jala lava kanika pita and konjo just one drop of ganga jala right illa moham udgaratla varuma ya moham ya moham udgaram eva okay Oh, so Kusha grass and places. Okay. Sorry, I'm going to study this. Okay. Uh, next it, word. Basically, he says Valmiki created a pot made of Darba grass uh. and uh, put uh, the, some sun or Kusha on it or something like that. Oh, okay. It's not about splitting the 
grass, but this is what it is. Oh, okay. Hmm. Okay. Uh, vanam forest. Forest. Yeah. Uh, Sharaha. Arrow. Yes. Arrow. Shataha. This is one. No, I think it is either shut or. Uh, yeah, shut is better. No visarga here. Number six. Yeah. Number six. Saraha. Lake. Lake. Manasarovar. Sarah. Mm. Yeah. Hayaha. Horse. Horse. Okay. Hayavadana. Have you I agree. Have you seen I that agree. Girish Karnad play? Hayavadana? No. <laughs> Haya is uh, uh, horse faced. Mm. Okay. Now uh, we can go through these also. These talk the give you the, how the vowels uh, come about. Okay. Anybody else want to try? Actually, Shata, the, the dictionary says it's a part of the larger to be a part or a portion of Satati. Shatava. Ah no, Adivandu, it's a verb. Apo Shathaha Kadayade. It is not haha, there's no uh, visarga there. No, no, I changed it. There was a visarga, so I said take it as shut uh, oh, okay, as six. Verb kudukamata. Usually dhatu uh, they don't give here. So they want okay, to introduce only words. Okay, got it. Karaha uh, hand. Hmm. Akaha crow. Hmm. Dinam day. Hmm. Deepaha light. Um, yeah. Guru. Guru, hmm. Kupaha is well. Well, Krupa is that Krupa? Krupa. Ah, okay, yeah, it's it doesn't matter. However you pronounce, however you are used to, it's fine. That's okay. Krupa, yeah, it's like uh, compassion. Pitrunam. Yeah. Hmm. Ah, Pitrunam. So Pitrunam, Pitr Rinam. Rinam. Any Rinam debt towards your Pitr ancestral debt. Yeah. Kruptam is uh, concise. Mm, okay. Medaha is. Uh, Megha. Uh, Megha is cloud. Mm. Shailaha. Mountain. Okay. Shri Shailaha. Oh, Shailaha mountain. Okay. Ah. Loka is world. Mm. Loka. Loka. So uh, change this to Loka. Huh. Just give me more one minute. Yeah. Mm. Lokaha. Loka is a yeah, world. Nauka is boat. Mm. Kamsaha. I know that it's a name, but I don't know the meaning. Yeah, Kamsaha. Kamsa. The Rakshasa. Yes. Mm. Or Asura. I know. Who is he? Uh, Krishna's mama. Mama of Krishna. Yeah. Mm. Kamsaha is uh, uh, swan. Swan. Right. Uh, you can work out all this and try to see how to write if you are not familiar with the letters if you are familiar with the letters you can skip and move on to the next uh, section um we have time we can study for 10 more minutes okay uh, okay so next person can start May, i else? can do it sure. or is there anybody else okay no. uh, okay. kalaha time okay Talaha, a palm tree or a beat in the music. Ah, nice. Yes. Yeah, this is a, okay. Pasaha is a rope. Bharaha, mm -hmm. weight. Yagaha, yagnya. Labaha, uh, this is a gain. Uh, right. Charaha, a spy. Yes. And Davaha, fire, uh, forest, forest fire. Forest fire, yeah. Mm. Then Balaha boy, Maraha god of love. Yes, Manmatha. And Maraha. Ramaha. Mm. Ramaha, we know. Vadaha argument. Maraha is who? Maraha Kamaha. Manmatha. Maraha. Mm. Mara Janaka Sodari Kilvatrakila. Mm. In a song. Ah, Mara Janaka is Kama's uh, uh, father, who is Vishnu, uh, uh, and Vishnu's Sodari is uh, Ambar, uh, Devi. Oh. Mm. Mm. Then uh, uh, Vadaha is argument. Yes. Uh, Kavihi poet. 
yes khane hi is a mine right mine uh, like as in a, quarry yeah mm. then chitti hi chitti hi is a collection okay rishi hi is rishi ravi hi san hari hi sir yeah is chitti not pyre um chitti oh, ch- ियल पाइल then uh, you'll have to use the word very carefully <laughs> when you're composing that's all huh. now uh kirihi means a bear mm-hmm. and girihi mountain manihi yes. a uh, precious stone titihi mm-hmm. a day vidihi a rule ah uh, vidihi can be rule it can also mean brahma oh. because he is the decider of fate Mm. So vidhi is a fate, hmm. and then uh, kshitihi is earth. Earth. Yeah. Okay. Someone else can try. Kota ha. Kita ha. So the Kota. so if you see the way it is arranged, you have a, and then uh, there is e e. These are all in dirgha e here. Kita ha will be insect. Yes. Yes. Deepaha is a light. Hmm. Ilaha is blue. Bhimaha is someone who is very aggressive. Yes. Uh, Viraha is uh, someone who is brave. Hmm. Piraha. Siraha. Why is then Bhima in as uh, Shiva? Is somebody yeah. who is in a uh, meditative state and not yeah. an aggressive? Ugra swarupam dhane. He is. Rudra. Bhima na terrible da. Ugra swarupa hai. At least what who, who causes fear, normally right? Normally, uh, the temple Bhima rupa. Hmm. It's quite. Uh, I can actually. I, one of these days, I'll take a picture and send you. Namak ke apni irkane. See, when we look at him, it may seem like he is in a meditative no, 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 state. No, no, no. Shiva is always in meditative state. Not, no, no, it's quite. Uh, it's quite. It is not ugra at all. It is. It is I, I'll, I'll share a yeah, sure. ha, picture I have. Okay. Oh, is it so Bhima means aggressive? Is it? I thought terrible. Bhima... Bhayam. Bhayam. Bhayat to learn the word. Bhi bhayat. Iti. Bibheti asmati iti Bhima. Hmm. Bibheti asmati. Okay. Siraha. Hmm. I don't know. Siraha is the corner of a plow. It's it is a plow. Sira. Jiva ha is a living being. Hmm. Dhiraha is a dhiraha, dhiraha, dhairiyaha, dhira person, courageous, courageous person. Uh, okay. I have one question here. Dhira yes. is courageous and dhivara is fisherman, isn't it? Dhivara is fisherman. Yes, dhivara okay. is a fisherman. Oh, okay, thanks. Yeah. Dhiraha is a brave. So, is it Magadira movie? Yeah, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> <It's your>... <laughs> <laughs> logically, uh, is yellow. Uh-huh. Sorry, logically, you know. Uh, he that to declare it, it denotes patience. Let's like, thyrium, you know. Really, a bee, boy. No, no, bee, la. Dhi, I'm saying. Ah, dhi. Ha. Dhi, raha. Thyrium is more about strathum and and fortitude, the capacity. That, that's why in Gita we have dhira as a sthita pragya, one ah. who is uh, 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 equanimous in both sukham and dukham is a ah. dhira. He is not a courageous person who shows his bravery in the battlefield. That is a veera. Veera is more a person who has manodhiri. Um, so un- unshakable, like a mountain, unshakable. Uh-huh. So that's the veera. Uh, yeah. And even the veera, when you see a fisherman, has got to be very patient. That capacity of patience. इतने एंगा मुड़ चुके हैं रेल में. इल्ल द. ना ना वो तो सुनने वाले हैं. मारने तो पड़े इल्ल ना. Awesome में ना विपत्ति वाला. उत्पत्ति वाला
<laughs> nice. That helped me in remembering them. But it also helped oh, me to remember a lot of things yeah. that I work with. Yeah. Ha, pita. Pita ha yellow. yellow. Meenaha is a fish. Yes. Meenaha is cold. Mm-hmm. Eeraha is... Um... Diamond. Hira. Hira. Hira, that's the same. Okay, okay. Yeah. it there are many meanings hiraha can be lion snake uh, but the most common thing is diamond huraha hmm. i don't know what huraha hoof hoof okay kuranya hura kuranya sabam right kuranya raghu ha raghu is, uh, is raghu the king raghuvamsha raghu king yeah. गुरु इज दास्टर द टीचर vatuhu is the brahmachari yes vapuhu is um, deham sharira sharira body viduhu is i i don't know what viduhu is moon moon okay moon sutaha oh, vidu, viduhu is not wise no mm, vidushi mm. Mm. Ah, the, the that is a third the vidushi not vidhu this is the fourth one right ta ta the the मून सो विधु शेखर इज चंद्रशेखर शिव एंड वॉट इट से मीनिंग ऑफ कुरहूफ कुंब ऑफ द हॉर्स Or of hearts or uh, uh, any animal which has a hoof okay got it sutaha is a sun hmm. shudha is uh, depleted hunger 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 shudha uh, hunger okay so we'll stop with this crude uh, itself is hunger right now ga uh, crud is hunger crud pipasa pipasa so, yeah Mm. Krut is hunger. Pipasa is uh, thirst. So Krudha is also hunger. Krut mm. pipasa. So what do you recommend? Uh, how we uh, do our abhyas at home till the next class? There are remaining uh, words, right? Uh, if you can just write it down and see. But I think if you are all familiar with the Devanagari, you don't need to go through these. This is just a familiarization. uh as far as vocabulary goes you will have more vocabulary once you start reading all this At, until the next class i don't think you need to uh, okay. work on anything so as and when we have some abhyasa to do i'll let you know there are some very interesting words here like yeah uh... uh-huh. can we have on thursday also in case you're all free we can have two twice a week because beginning usually i don't like it if it's once a week because you will forget by the time it's seven days uh, so if we have once more in between then it makes sense that's